You ever have a hard time with all the possibilities when it comes to mid-journey and AI art? A little bit of analysis paralysis? Well, I've got something for you. Someone left a link to this reference sheet in my YouTube comments the other day and it's kind of mind-blowing. Let me just show you. Take a second and breathe this all in. I want to make it clear, I did not make this. Not mine at all. I do not know the person that made this, although I can discern it was a person that goes by the name of Randolin. Their Discord handle is right here if you'd like to contact them for any comments, revisions, or suggestions. If you want to leave them a thank you, I highly suggest doing that. Now let me go over how to read this. Okay, my understanding is that on the left side here, we have the original artwork of the artist, not generated by Midjourney. We have Rolf Armstrong, Lois Van Barla, beautiful name, beautiful artwork. And this goes on and on and on. There's quite a bit, but let's go back to the top. We have the artist's name in the second column here, and they've actually hyperlinked their names to their website or some part of their work. That's such a great feature. This reference page is just insane. Okay, then these next columns here specify the prompt that was used. We'll start at the top here with Mid Journey. So this is character by Mid Journey. This is rough charcoal by Mid Journey. Pencil character sketch by Mid Journey and character concept art. And then it's going to have those four prompts for each artist. Now there are a lot of black squares that show up. To be honest, sometimes that just happens when the page hasn't loaded correctly yet but other times I'm assuming it's because it just hasn't been filled out yet. So you might wanna stay tuned to this reference page as it gets updated, which I'm sure it will be. For Leo and Diane Dillon, we have their original art here, and then we have Mid Journey's interpretation of their art with different prompts. Here's a character by, and it sort of keeps their color palette. Here's a rough charcoal by, and it takes away the color, but still leaves their style. Here's pencil character sketch by, and these are just beautiful. I love that Mid Journey can handle that. Ooh, Anna Dittman, wow just juice those are unreal yeah i want to keep this video short but i want to point out the real power of this reference page look at the bottom here right now we're on the character slide but we also have landscapes cartoon comics paintings anime anthropomorphic sci-fi creatures mediums techniques time periods fashion print media styles games and miscellaneous Let's take a look at some of them really quickly. Here we have under landscapes. It's got the artist, but then it has landscape by, city by, and castles. Afromov. Look at Leonid Afromov. These are wild. Holy cow. I gotta write that one down. I do want to make a personal declaration here. Please do not use these artists in your prompt and then try to make money off of them. They've tried their whole lives to make money and it's been an uphill battle for them. Please do not take the essence of their art and package it as your own. Use this for entertainment purposes. I don't care if it's technically legal to do so. Just, just think about the ramifications of being able to package their art as your own. That's all I want to say. We'll go to another page, cartoon and comics. I guess it's mostly divided by what the artist is famous for, because I'm sure you could take artists from the landscape section and put them with comic book art prompts. Either way, ooh, look, look at Don Bluth, the art of animation drawing, and then it's got his perfectly here. Like that's just Mary Blair, if you wanted. Oh wow, these are these are so good but then we have paintings. Oh my God, it's got their date range and location of birth. Different mediums and techniques. These are powerful. Ami Gurumi, oh my God, look at that. I never heard of that before. That is something to know. You will never run out of ideas with a reference sheet like this. Take a quick look at the time periods and fashions. Incredible, incredible amount of work. Look how long this would take to make. I wanted to thank the person who shared it with me and the person who put it together. Randolin or Randolin, thank you so much. This is amazing work. The community could not be more grateful for your contribution. The link is below in the description. Hope you're doing well. Take care and I'll see you next time.